Another day, another attempt by China to lay claim on Indian territory and another befitting reply by the Indian government. After China gave new Chinese names to 30 locations across Arunachal Pradesh, here's how External Affairs Minister Dr. S. J. Shankar responded. I अरुणाचल प्रदेश भारत का स्टेट है पहले भी था अभी भी है आगे भी रहेगा तो ये नाम बदलने से कुछ नहीं होता और और ये लगा का विषय जो है नहीं एक्टिविस्ट होते हैं अब एक्टिविस्ट के अपने विचार होते हैं आप आप सब जानते हैं कि हमारी सेना जो है वो सीमा पे लाइन ऑफ एक्चुअल कंट्रोल का now, India has rejected what it calls the senseless attempts by China to rename places in Arunachal Pradesh. In a statement, the External Affairs Ministry stated that assigning invented names will not alter the reality that Arunachal Pradesh is, has been and will always be an integral and inalienable part of India. Remember, China calls Arunachal as Zagnan and it claims Arunachal as part of South Tibet. China had released the first such list of six places in 2017. The second one of 15 places was issued in 2021. And the third list with the names of 11 places was released back in 2023. Clearly, this reassertion of claims by China also comes a few weeks after Prime Minister Narendra Modi inaugurated the Sela Tunnel built at an altitude of 13,000 feet, strengthening the infrastructure of Arunachal Pradesh. But the big question we're asking on Nation tonight is, beyond words, how worried should India be about China's vicious expansionist policy? What strategy should India adopt to counter China at the border regions? And what role can a region like Tibet and countries like US play in the Indo-Sino relations?